Hey guys, in my continuing social series on how to analyze data with ClickSense, I'm going to walk you through a brief workflow of how one can uncover some insights and then create new insights that they might want to keep track of. I start my journey within the ClickSense Enterprise Hub, and I have some charts that are being monitored. In this case here, these are just some simple key performance indicators on the value of the collection. I'm interested in the total collection value. By selecting this chart, not only do I see the current value, but I could also look at chart history. And I also could do a side-by-side -side comparison. I want to learn more about this particular value of this collection, so I'm going to click View in App, and this will bring me directly to the sheet where this particular KPI is stored. Now I can look at other particular insights regarding this collection. Immediately sorted by value, you can see this particular console here, which is the Neo Geo console. I'm going to confirm that selection, and we're going to further dive in and perform more analysis on this. With my selections already maintained, I'm just going to navigate to a different sheet, and now we're looking at overall price change from when the collection started to the current date. We can see that we have an $8,000 value overall from the period when it started. We also can see the Neo Geo system contributed a lot to this value with an overall change over the course of three years of $440. I want to keep track of this, so I'm going to right click on this chart and select Create Alert. Here we'll call this Neo Geo value. And we're going to add a measure, and we're going to keep track of the change. We're going to refine our data, and we're going to use our titles, and we're going to use the current selection in the app to keep track of this particular dimensional value. Now for the condition, we're going to look at the change, and we're going to say when the value increases over 450. By clicking here to initiate the change, you can see the preview alert is blank. That means that change has not been met. We click Next. And we're going to allow these notifications to happen upon reload, which is happening daily. I'd like to also share this with a colleague of mine. So I'm going to select my friend Kaike and click Create. Now that the alert has been created, Kaike and myself will be alerted when the change value reaches 450.